So perhaps the biggest thing that I've seen at the show that excites me, probably one of the most, is the new Garrett G-Series Turbo. Now, the G-Series Turbo packs a lot of power in a tiny package. If you're familiar with turbos, the G-Series is about the size of a, of a T28, but it can make up to 600 horsepower. Uh, it uses a lot of the technology from the uh, Unobtainium Motorsports turbos and um, has a lot of the durability features from the OEM side. So it has like um, Motorsports Aero and the compressor and the uh, turbine. It has a ported shroud, which is really unusual for a really small frame turbo. Ball bearing center section um, with uh, some things to uh, improve the oil sealing. Uh, it also has a Marm turbine wheel. Marm is a really high temperature alloy. Not too many people use it in the aftermarket. It has an investment cast um, uh, turbine housing, so it's like a nice, clean, trim, lightweight uh, housing with a V-band outlet. It also has a V-band that um, holds it to the center section, so it's really, if you wanted to change turbine housings, it's really, really quick. Uh, the turbine housing also has like a machine exducer, so, so better flow on that side. And um, the package is short, compact, really awesome. This is a really exciting turbo. I mean, it's a uh, mid-frame power and a compact size. So uh, there's all kinds of projects we gotta use this sucker on once it once it comes out in about six months. So um, perhaps like the ultimate application of the G-Series turbo is the this Raptor motor, full race exhaust manifolds with the twin G-Series G turbos. This thing's gonna like kick some ass. Now I wanna get a Raptor. That kinda sucks, but I really don't want a Raptor, but now I kinda want one just for the turbo kit.